Here's Ken Rice with a check of what's coming up tonight at 11 on KDK TV. Ken? Bob, the convicted killer who was on the run for two weeks. Tonight, police say he survived in part by drinking from a stream and eating watermelon he found on a farm. We have those and more new details after his capture today. Plus, what's going to happen if the United Auto Workers strike the big three Detroit car makers with a deadline set for tomorrow night? And how cool does Ray say it's going to be in the morning? All those stories and more ahead at 11. Bob? Yeah, bring it on. I'll take that. Hey, Chris, before we go, I know you're an NBA fan, and the NBA right now is trying to uh, change the way teams rest players who are healthy. The load management topic came up today, and they're trying to um, reduce that because television uh, is really complaining about the fact that in many of these games, two, three, four guys of uh, you know a team are not available. Uh, Cleveland, for example, Golden State went there this year, and the whole team was out basically, yet... Golden State still somehow won the game, but that's not why people came there. Uh, what's your take on this? I'm usually pretty all about the player empowerment side, and this is the league cracking down a little bit on, on sort of this manipulation. Uh, I'm going to say this. You have risen to prominence if you're the NBA and clearly set yourself apart from hockey and in many ways Major League Baseball because you have turned yourself into a league that is about individual star talent. Don't be surprised when after those talents tend to sit down more often than not because they want to rest and you're managing the, you know, the workload here that people start to get upset. I'm all right with this. They're basically making it so that you've got to play 65 games to be eligible for any of the big awards. I'm good with that. Fans being happier in buildings and TV executives being happier and shelling out more money ultimately means more money for the players themselves. No, well said. I totally agree. And you got to play those games. And if you're going to arrest one, that's it. You can't have multiple people, and people pay a lot of money. Television uh, certainly pays a lot of money. All right, Chris, that signal from you means I'm at the end. I guess we're out of time. We'll do it again tomorrow night right here at 1035. Join us for another edition of the Ireland Contracting Nightly Sports Call.